Hi guys, it's Cliff again and here I am visiting a client's flat. This time it's a famous influenza. So here we are at the flat and let's take a look. Uh, heavy door, heavy door. <gasps> oh, so nice. Look at the light. But first, what you see? This mirror. This is not good. Too much chi, it startles you a little bit. So this is something we want to avoid even though it's in a different room from the hallway. Mirror and a head, not the best thing. And, but let's go into the room and take a look. Okay, the bed is not in the best place already, you can tell. Your head is really way too close to the door. And what kind of nightstand is this? And then, it, I mean, I would rather turn my bed around so at least you can enter from both sides. But here you have lots of energy coming straight up your legs. A bit like facing your feet towards the door, not the best. Let's see the other side of the room. So, okay, okay, fine. Let's look at the rest of the apartment. Nice kitchen. Um, I mean, yeah, this is not the best type of thing, but it's okay. And then this is where she normally works. So this is the main problem here. Because you're working right here, your back is towards the whole kitchen and everything. Trying to get out of frame, but Sorry. like that's the main thing she's in. Okay, so it's really bad. And then you're sitting here with your background when you're doing your virtual meetings like that towards the kitchen. Not the best, but I guess we have a really, really nice living space over here. See that? So we have a small dilemma. This or that. Let's see what we can do. So this is the current plan, which is not great. First, the bedroom, I will move it like this. And I'll move the wardrobe from here to there, so that's out of sight. And for the living space, this is having your back towards the kitchen, which is not great. So instead, I'm going to rotate this there so that it's more like this. And I'm going to move this dining table away. Let me take it away. And I'm going to move the entire couch backwards so it lets in a lot more light from the window. And then this dining area with the newfound space, I'm going to put it right there. So you can sit here and work. So this is my new open space, my work area, and a much wider living space. Let me show you how it looks like now. So this is the side view, and this is in real life. Is that nice? So here we have the workspace, which is in its own little contain, contained area, like a nice office space. So when you're sitting, your back is not towards the kitchen anymore. You have this nice background with this artwork behind and I have a great view of the rest of the room. This is known as the command position. And as I have this table here, I create an alternative area to sit and work, which is really nice because when I'm sitting over here, I have a great view of the room and I'm close to the window. So we have two places to work on the dining table and the desk and the couch being further from the TV creates a much more spacious looking living space, not to mention opening up this big window. Now let's look at the bedroom. So we go to the bedroom and you can see that the bed is in a nice, much nicer position. And when you enter the room, you see this beautiful vista, armchair and your nice decoration. So this is nice and balanced. Yeah. So now you know.